What up guys, Ankle Spangin here, and today we are playing as Tundra Fizz Jungle in honor of our cousin Evan, because he decided that he wanted to try and pick this up, and I decided that, hey, I could try and see if I could have a little fun doing it. So, I'm going to need a hard leash, I'm saying this right now because I'm running 30 OO Masteries just for fun, and um, we'll, we'll see how this goes. Because I've seen Jungle Fizz a couple times, and it's always seemed really fun, but I've never done it myself as far as I can remember. If I have, it's been a very, very long time. Um, wait, no, I did it like twice ever. Yeah, yeah, I did it like twice ever. Still really fun though. Uh, not the most practical thing in the world, but still it's actually something that can kind of work. So I will be doing it. Look at the pretty butterflies just floating away as they just fly off into the distance. It's like when Ash releases his Butterfree and everyone cries, because that is just sad as fuck. Look at that, it's gone. And another one takes its place. It's like the circle of life. The cycle of life and death continues. Wrong champion. I'm playing Fizz. Wait, Fizz taking a nap. And now I'm getting laughed at, huh? I should laugh too. <laughs> okay, anyways, looking at the teams real fast for you guys. We got Jungle Ash on the other side, Top Mundo, Mid Ziggs, Ezreal Lux bot lane, and then we got Xander playing the top Jarvan, Kitty on that bottom Thresh lane with Angie on the Ezreal, and then Velka is mid, and of course, me supporting in the jungle. Or, not supporting, but playing Fizz in the jungle. So actually, taking like damn near no damage off of that whole camp a fantastic leash indeed let's go ahead and grab our W here which is actually probably what I should have grabbed in the first place because of the huge dot damage let's go ahead and just jump here so it, I actually can do that jump without resetting aggro which is good to know and it's looking like I won't die but I will be taking a lot of damage off of uh, clearing this camp so let's go ahead and just jump up there get the red and I may need to back before blue because I don't have any potions so maybe I shouldn't actually I shouldn't because I do have wait shit I don't have mana wait if I smite it early whoa that first blood already coming down looks like he hit the level two first and it will just be destroying him great job Xander but if I just jump on this, then smite it, then drop the W. Now let's see. Come on. Come on. Come on, Fizz. I have faith in you. Kill the blue. Kill it in time. You must. We gotta do it. Gotta do it, Fizz. Come on. Trusting the 30 oh for the more damage. Yeah, not even close. Going to take out that blue. No problem. Let's go ahead and just kill this thing. Pop our sea stone straight in again. Grab our level 3, or our level 1 Q as we hit level 3, I mean. And, let's go, let's just go back real fast. So, I think, I think I'll probably just get the Trailblazer for the sake of doing this. Um, oh, maybe, maybe, that could be good. That actually could be good. Shit. Uh, because of the way his W works. I'm gonna try it. You guys may think I'm a little crazy for trying it, but I'm gonna try it. Because simply for the way his W works when you Q, if you smite people and add that bonus dot as well, like, you can tick down a lot of people's HP. So, maybe we'll do that to this Ziggs in here. And by maybe, I mean I'm about to just E and flash onto him. So let's go ahead and give that a shot. Looks like some damage coming out of there. And maybe, so the Q from Velka is going to miss. Let's go ahead and just, uh, come on. I'm right here waiting on the wings here to do some damage. It looks like, okay, damage is not going to be done. But looks like a kill going down in bot lane. Great job there. Let's go ahead and just hop over this wall. Get our potion sticking right now. Use my Q just for an auto attack. Kind of reset-esque thing. And maybe... Maybe I'll be able to get a gank off on him now. The only problem is I know I do need to be a bit more gank heavy, I believe, as Jungle Fizz, because obviously my clear speed is not going to be stupendous. Um, <clears throat> so we'll see what we can do. 
but for now, let's go ahead and see if we can just run up in this lane on Ziggs as the wave pushes. I was kind of planning that. And let's see, so he, if this is warded, which is very possible, I could have just wasted some time, which is a bit of a shame, but what you going to do? So I think I'm actually just going to go bottom, uh, jump over this Krugs wall real fast with my Playful Trickster, and then kill those with my Smite, because, as you guys may or may not know, the Krugs Smite buff is very nice, as it provides you with that stun on minion camps. And let's see, do I just get my level... Do I just level my E up still? Do I level normal abilities first? I I guess so. I don't really know exactly what else to do. And Ziggs did recall there, so that's a bit of a shame. But if Carnage can poke him down just a little bit, I think we could probably kill him without uh, without much trouble. So I don't know how the Jungle Ash is doing, but um, it'll be the battle of the unconventional junglers here soon. So let's just keep killing these Merc Wolves camps. Uh, or this Merkwolf camp and trying to get more experience and gold under our belt until I see a good ganking opportunity because as right now uh, it Looks like Carnage doesn't even need me Xander doesn't really need me and Mundo just hit six so Oh wait, there's his ultimate now actually his level one ultimate isn't that It's not that scary uh, like it does some healing but it's not that scary. So here I come up right now. Looks like this will be one kill going off on him. Now let's go ahead and drop this smite right there. Boom! The skirmisher's saber dropping some pain off on her. Look at this, boys! And one more. Yeah! There's the kill! Taking her out. So, counter gank successful. Let's go ahead and push this wave out there. And that will be a dead ass jungle. So, Great, great job on my part. I would like to just sing my own praises there. A perfectly timed counter gank, even though, whoops. God, I just missed, like, all of those minions. And, all right, well, Mundo should still miss. Actually, no, he's got his E, doesn't he? So he's not going to, he's not bound to miss a lot of these. I do apologize. I recorded a video right before this one, too. So my throat's, like, a little, a little something. Let's see. Let's grab this here and then. Should I just go for standard build? Just for fun? I mean, that sounds fun to me, but I don't think I should go for much, uh, much. Like, I don't think I should just get the Sapphire Crystal and leave myself with only one potion. Because if I fuck up in the jungle or don't find a good time to get a gank off, there's no way I'm going to be killing people. So let's see. We got the time at duking it out with the. Mundo, who's ulting right now, looks like Mundo may be backing off the throttle a little bit here. Because maybe he realizes that he's not going to be killing our Jarvan. So, bot lane very pushed up still. Not really a good ganking opportunity for me. I'm actually going to wait to smite this camp. Because it does give me a buff, in a sense. It uh, replaces a lot, well not replaces, but it does heal you for quite a lot. And that will uh, give me some of that HP back that I lost. So let's see, one more camp and I should be level 6, and then I can just go snipe someone with my ultimate and gank them that way, so let's go ahead and just kill this Crimson Raptor camp, and whoop, Q through that, and keep autoing it down, there's my level 6, and it looks like Lux did go down, so great job bot lane once again, I still don't have like a sweeper or anything, so I do need to be careful of that, but let's see, if I can hit him with my ultimate here, Let's go ahead and go for it, and nailed him with that ultimate! Zin's going to be taking a lot of pain right there, and that will be the kill going down on him, so that- OH! Oh god, the Ash counter ganks! Holy shit! Oh my god, that Ash counter gank! What the fuck? She just wrecked me! Oh my lord! Oh god. Okay, well, at least we got Carnage of Blue with, uh, with killing Ziggs for him. And then, um, and then Ash killed me. So, I mean, that's a bit of a shame, but it's not the end of the world. So, damn, that wrecked me, though. That arrow just destroyed me. Uh, maybe I could have avoided it if I was faster. I don't know if my E was up. I don't think it was up. But, if it was, doesn't really matter now. Either way, I can take this blue for myself. I don't have any potions, so I decided to get my sheen instead. But, uh, since Carnage already has a blue, 
I can just go ahead and take this one for myself. And it looks like, okay, Angie just didn't feel like playing League of Legends with us. So, oh, welcome back. <laughs> looks like she is back, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go ahead and go, said, go ahead and see if we can dive this guy. Because with my healing reduction, we definitely should be able to, maybe. Maybe. Whoa, there it is, Andy. Okay, great job. Moral support. Let's go ahead and just drop the pain off on her. Looks like this will be a bunch of damage, and she will be going down. Give me that red buff back, bitch. So you think you the one counter gank? And you can't counter gank a fizz. You can't do that. But that will put us at 2-1-1. One one. The Ash Jungle actually has the only two kills on their team right now. So this is looking like it's going pretty well for us, boys. And let's see, I've been in uh, 3 of 10 kills. So statistically... The Ash jungle is performing much better than my Fizz jungle um, because she is in 100% of the team's kills. I am only in 30%. So, you know, statistic wise, she's dunking me. And for that, I applaud you. I applaud you. If I do sub my ultimate, I can drop another alt snipe off on someone, maybe. Looks like Velkaz hit him with the Q, and there is his satchel charge. No knockback left, and there's the ultimate! And he did flash, I believe, actually, to get out of that. So, if I can just tag him with my ultimate, he's going to go down. But Carnage is definitely laying down the pain right now on this boy, and he is for sure feeling it. So let's see if we can get a sick dive off on this. Whoa! Was that an Ash arrow I saw? Oh my lord! That damage was going ahead and drop the ultimate! Damn it! I'm dead. I'm so bad. What the fuck? I'm bad. Damn it. Oh wait. Wait, Zig's ignited. See, it was an elaborate bait the whole time. Elaborate bait. It was just an elaborate bait from the very beginning. Uh, I could have killed Ash if I used my uh, my little challenging smite. So again, the product of me being a shitter will cause me to die without a kill. Uh, I did not think I would take as much damage as I did, but then it hit me after I died that I am running 30-0-0 masteries. Um, there, there was just a lot that went wrong there, because I did not think the entire situation through. My greed had blinded me. And my cockiness destroyed my mind. So let's see if we can... Oh, boink. Help at all. Not really. It does not seem to be. And Ash... Probably going to be picking up a red here soon. So I'm just going to waltz on over there. See if I can catch her off guard. Because even though the minion kind of stalked me... If I can just get the drop on Ash, she is going to... She's going to die. So let's go ahead and just jump over this wall. Oh, that's warded. So now he knows. He knows. They know. Go away. Go away, Mundo. Shit. I'm coming. I'm coming. Shit. I'm coming. Shit. All right. Jump over this wall is to not take damage. And let's see. All right. If I come in from the behind. Yellow. Tis I. The Frenchiest Fry. So let's see. There's no one in there. Oh, whoa, looks like we're going to drop this ultimate off on him. Shabam, look at that damage. See, oh! You have been oh! Oh! Wow, we he hurt a lot. So, well, that will still be a kill for a kill. And, uh, you know, I'm going to say worth because we got out. Or, he got out with, with an assist, not a kill. I apologize. I thought he got the kill. But I got the kill instead, so I'm going to have to, uh, you know, sh keep showing my cocky side, I guess. And, uh, well, you see, at this point in the game, when I've been playing this cockily, I can't just back off the throttle or else people will know something's up, you know what I'm saying? So let's take another drink. Put, or take the stops off of this destruction death train. And let's go wreck some more face. After we grab a friendly red buff, of course. Come here, red bramble back. I am going to slay you. Oh yeah, you guys want to know a fun fact about Fizz while I'm thinking about it? Uh, here, let me let me just ask you a trivia question, if you will. Uh, let's see who gets the answer right. What is the name of Fizz's shark in his ultimate? Yeah, you guys, 
Do you guys know the answer? Because you guys might, you may or may not know the answer to this one. I'm not sure. You may or may not. So it looks like this dive is going to come out. Let's see if we can, oh, okay. Okay. So let's see, there's one dodge and shabam! There's the ult coming out. Boom! Wow, Angie, that'll be heartbreaking right there. But now back to the trivia question. The answer, and I'm sure many of you would have guessed this, is not Earth. The name of Fizz's shark is in fact not Earth, as I'm sure many of you would be inclined to believe. So there goes Fizz's, or not Fizz, but Thresh, or Ezreal, that's the one. Ezreal's flash. And by the way, the name of Fizz's fish is actually Chomper. It is Chomper. So, the more you know, just just for your little fun fact, uh, his name is Chomper. He yells Earth, and I'm not too sure why. Uh, maybe it's just kind of like an angry, an angry yell. But, yeah. There you go, Chomper. It looks like, whoa, that hook coming out! And the ultimate laser, whoa, that flash is not going to pick it up! Come on, there's the heal, and there's the void rip! And the last bop taking him out. Carnage on a killing spree, putting him in what, 3 0 and 1? What a beast! And let's go ahead and just grab up on this blue. Whoa, 4 0 and 1, the rampage! And that will be the shutdown, no more rampage. So rest in peace. Whoa! Oh, here he comes! There's one kill! And let's see the bop right there! Holy shit, I'm coming in! The double kill! Here I come, here I come, here I come, here I come! And. Ah! There's the ace! Picking up that last little KS, dropping on him with my big old booty, my big old fish booty. He probably didn't enjoy that too much, did he? So let's see, dropping the flag over there as a quick escape route in case Ziggs decides to do anything kooky. I like it. I like the way you think. So let's go ahead and just ward this, because I have an idea, if you will. An if, if you will. Will Ash decide to come this way? No, she will not. Will Ziggs? Oh, Ziggs. Oh, Ziggs. Where are you? What the heck? He's so far up. Yo, this Ziggs is dead. I'm going to drop my challenging smite off on him. I'm going to nail him with my fizz. And let's go ahead and just do the... Combo whoosh! Oh, that was a little out of order. But this will be a big hunk of damage going off on him, taking him out just like that. Looks like Lux is in a bad situation. She got the death sentence nailed onto her. And let's go for this dragon. This is so free. We just destroyed their entire team out of nowhere. So, no smite here, but, uh, you know, that ain't important. And let's go ahead and just back off on this. And it looks like we are being mean to them. So let's go ahead. He said my mother was on sale at the local sushi joint. <laughs> That's so fucking troll, but kind of funny. Because <laughs> Velkaz, you know, he's a squid, just in case you guys didn't get the joke. But <clears throat> enough with that, enough mean jokes. Let's see it. Let's see the bouncing bomb going to Bop Angie right in her booty. And let's see, the light binding will not land, but the geometry will not be accurate either. So you're going to have to redo your calculations, my friend. And let's see if we can stop her at these Crimson Raptors. Here we go, the hook, and what the f- You guys saw that bullshit, didn't you? You all did, I know you did. Alright, let's go ahead, wait, let's just get this, and then I can go in. Wait. Hello! BAM! Look at that damage! And this will be one kill. Let's go ahead and see if we can launch the ultimate right there as a zoning method. I never had any intents of killing him that way. And BAM! There's the triple kill. Come on. Come on, gimme this. Gimme this. Alright. Just gonna flash over it. Drop the E. BOOM! There's the quadra kill. And that will be the Fizz Jungle quadra kill hopping over people like it was straight butter baby and let's actually not wait am I in time to get a pinata there's the ash ultimate go go Xander go Xander please you hate me oh wait 
Wait. Oh, no, never mind. It's not enough time to be a Penta anymore. Never mind. I think if she was the last person alive, it still could have been a pinata kill. But, since she was very clearly not the only person alive at that point in the game, I might be dying here. Alright, come on. Uh, 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 come on! <laughs> oh god. Oh god. We're good. <laughs> the blue buff actually never had a real chance of killing me. Uh, just in case you guys were wondering, there was literally zero chance I was going to die to that. I, I knew it the whole time as well. Wait! I haven't upgraded this thing! God damn it, I forgot! Alright, let's see, where's the Magus enchantment? There we go, we got that big enchantment coming out here. So, a bunch of AP coming out. We got a bunch of CDR. Whoa, that Vel'Koz damage! And no, the game is over! So, 10-3-2, let's go ahead and just end that. Another very fast game for us tonight fantastically played by my entire team. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you like it very listening out. If you want to, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Twitch, or my second channel. I'll throw links in the description below. And as always, I love you guys. It'll be a wonderful day. Peace!